Giovanni Gerardo here from Moltong Branch. This is C2 Albatross, Lesson 8, Pre-Vlog. So this week's project asks the students to create their own stadium or sports facility. The focus is on American football, which in my experience, the students have no idea how this sport is played, how many fans support this sport in the United States, how big it is only really in the United States. So I want to change the focus completely. And it's a combination of most of my classes are middle school. So due to the cancellations, most of them will be gone this week. I want to have the chance to only have one group because in my classes, I'll only have between three and five students so that I can direct the students and making their own presentation of lifestyles of the rich and famous, which is going to be my gimmick. The reason I chose this topic of lifestyles of the rich and famous because it starts off in lesson eight stimulus of what would you do if you had one billion dollars. And the media cards offered here show various materialistic items as well as things that you could do as a philanthropist. So I want to hone in on that and kind of show a South Korean version of Lifestyles of the Rich and Famous by asking the students and challenging them what would they do with this money or what have famous people in this country already done with a certain amount of money. So the three sections of the project, which are financing, location, architecture. I'm going to focus still on financing and somewhat location, depending on what the students want to do. But as far as architecture and professional level sports facility, I'm going to throw that out and let them choose what they would do with this certain amount of money, whether they want to continue with building a sports facility or change it up to any specific idea that they would like to do it themselves. So some apps I'm going to use are FX Guru, Video FX, Video Show, possibly Movie Booth FX, and still possibly Comic Strip It. Uh, the primary apps I will use are the first three that I said. And like I said, I will be the director, which means I will be using my tab to record everything. So there's no reason to unlock anything for the students, any apps, if that has not been done yet. Um, this will work especially well with any of your classes if they are middle school and you have a lot of students out because of the exams, or if just if you have a small class of elementary students. With your classes that are bigger, you will have to do a lot more facilitation and unlocking apps for the students if you want them to use these apps. So keep that in mind with the whole presentation time at the end. As far as financing goes, I'm going to have them keep this in because again, I'm letting them have freedom to choose what they're planning on creating as far as a sports facility or a space station, etc. whatever they wanna use with their money to create. They're not gonna have enough in the scenario. So they are gonna need a certain level of financing and I want them to think about how they can raise the money so that they can create whatever facility that they plan on creating and think about how they can raise these funds. So location will be a very minor aspect in this project because in my experience with all my kids, students are not very familiar with the different geographical locations of wherever they live. So I'm going to keep it fairly local to where I'm at and just ask them what they would like around whatever building they care to create. So like what kind of amenities are offered in conjunction with whatever they create, as well as what's surrounding the building that could attract more people if they want people in this building or not. And like I said, I'm going to throw out architecture and instead I'm gonna add an element of drama I'm going to go with, like I said in the beginning, lifestyles of the rich and famous and have them add their own type of dramatic 
way of implementing whatever they want to do. So I'm going to ideate different uh, scenes that are common in popular drama shows here in Korea, as well as shows back in the States if they know about those, or Western television shows. And we're going to add that element in there, and that I think will take the majority of the time with this project, because that's where acting comes in, creating the scene so that the students are satisfied with their work. So hopefully everything will go well. I will not have a class until Thursday, so my post vlog will not be up until much later because most of my classes are canceled this week. So I will get the post vlog to you as soon as I get my recordings in. And I hope this helps you out and gives you different ideas of how you can approach this project. I will see you in a week. Take care. Giovanni Dredd on Mokdong out. Peace.